University TV watchers, today we're at Fitchburg State College. Do you ever have to look down at your shirts and remember where you are? That's why you're sitting next to me. Oh, cool. All right, everybody, get ready for an excellent tour. Race you. Sure. Mm, looks good, thank you. Fitchburg State College is located in a mid-sized New England city called Fitchburg, Massachusetts. It's about 50 miles outside of Boston. There's tons of hiking and rivers in the area, plus all the shopping and great pizza you can find. 30 buildings grace Fitchburg's campus, including an elementary school providing personal training for education majors. More than 3,400 full-time undergrads are enrolled at Fitchburg. 46% men and 54% women. The average class size is 16. Only 50 miles uh, west of Boston, and we're right on the commuter line, so students can hop on the train, head right into the Boston for the night or a weekend. Um, it's a beautiful location. We're surrounded by hills and mountains. They're skiing in the winter and hiking in the summer and canoeing and kayaking. In Massachusetts, the weather, it's a little dry. It's a little wet. It's, you know, there's some snow, but it's not extreme. You get a little taste of everything. The history here is incredible. We are huge in the Industrial Revolution. We are a huge mill city. We are part of the Underground Railroad. You definitely get a sense of where you are on the time scale. In general, a student looking to be admitted into Fitchburg needs a minimum GPA of 3.0. If students fail to meet that 3.0 requirement, though, they may still be considered for admission. And at that point, we're going to look for the standardized test scores to be stronger as the GPA dips below that 3.0 requirement. Um, in addition to that, we are going to ask for an essay. And even though we're looking at state standards, um, we're also still trying to look at every student as an individual, recognizing the strengths that they bring to the college. In-state students can expect to pay roughly $6,400 a year in tuition and fees, while out-of-state students will pay around $12,500. The estimated cost to live on campus is a little over $7,000. There are more than 20 majors, 60 tracks and minors, and four pre-professional programs at Fitchburg State. Communications media, business, education, and nursing are just a few of student favorites. Nursing students work hard from the beginning here at Fitchburg State. Tons and tons of hours are spent getting hands-on experience right here in the nursing lab. How are you feeling today? All right, I'll check that out for you. We get the students very active, and I think learning should be active, it should be fun, and it should have an application to their life right away. So um, that means I'm gonna do a variety of things. It's not the boring sit in straight rows and I'm gonna lecture and you're gonna memorize. It's all about, um, you know, not what is it, but what do you do with it is what my classes are all about. Fitchburg State has 191 full-time faculty members, nearly 100% of whom are tenured or on the tenure track. 92% have their terminal degree. So what makes this school so great, so wonderful that you think the other students should come here? Teachers. It's weird, I even, it's not even football or athletics to teach it. Teachers care. They do. If they, if they see that you're actually participating, coming to class, hard to fail. Um, because the class sizes are so small. You can always speak up. You're never afraid to talk in class because there's only like 10 people around you. Your teacher is, he or she is just normal, like approachable. Their office hours are always there. They're proud of me. I'm proud of them. We're in communication with whatever we're doing in our life. Um, it's incredible. Like I've never experienced such a relationship with my professors. That's, that's the best part, I think. The Fitchburg Falcons are currently ranked as an NCAA Division III school. So we practice about two and a half hours of just practice. Then we have maybe lifting is an hour, meetings is like two hours, and then we have pool time, which is an hour, which is pretty fun. Well, that's nice. So how do you balance schoolwork and practicing for football? For college, they expect you to do it, but he helps. He gives us mandatory study hall for under 2.3 or lower, and all freshmen has to take it. So I guess when you're about junior senior, you kind of got the, got the concept of it. Home sweet home. Find yourself in one of seven residential halls available at Fitchburg. Some are even multi-building townhouses. I love living on campus. Um, I love where my classes are, are like two feet away from where my dorm is. I just love living with so many other people and like if I'm bored, I can find someone else so easily. Fitchburg State has more than 60 student-run clubs and organizations, as well as intramural sports and other recreational activities. Plus, the campus has three sororities and two fraternities. In the year for freshmen, we have Rock the Block, which is an amazing program 
Um, we have all the organizations on um, one of the streets on campus so students can sign up and get informed about what kind of clubs and organizations are on campus. Also we have novelties, it's a lot of fun. You get like free fish and you know you have a little pet in your uh, dorm now. Write, act, or produce? You can be among graduates like best-selling author Robert Salvatore, actor Patrick O'Brien Dempsey from the movie Miracle, and Emmy-nominated reality TV show producer Paul Coyne. Say Survivor, Amazing Race, Picture yourself on stage, screen, in the operating theater, or classroom arena. The show starts here at Fitchburg State College. All right, guys. Well, our time is up here. I'm Shayna for University TV. And I'm Nicole, and I hope to see you real soon. Bye.